everyone, this is Amit Dhan of AmitDhan.com. Today I'll have another episode of non-affiliated notebook review video and I'll be presenting the Moleskine Pro Pad which is the pocket size. On this channel I do non-affiliated, unbiased and honest reviews. There are no affiliated links. I do not take money from anyone. For that re reason, you'll get totally honest and unbiased opinion because you know I have no interest in selling uh, or putting any links anywhere to make money off you. So the notebook I have is the Moleskine Pro Collection, Pro Pad, and this is the pocket size. And uh, we have uh, still the original wrapping. So let's just take, or let's just open the wrapping, then we'll take a look at some of the specs. So here we have the notebook. So the paper is 100 gram per meter square, and the pages are uh, detachable. And then we have uh, optimized note taking, so there should be something inside which makes it different than you know a regular notebook. And then on the back of the notebook we have Pro Pad, and this is nine by fourteen centimeter or three and a half by five and a half, so it's a pocket size. Here actually we have something, uh, so an original and simple graphic layout to help you organize your notes. This notebook actually is not, it does not open like a book, so this is a flip top uh, notebook, so you open it uh, on the top. Inside the flap, looks like they have a little bit of instructions here, it tells you to cut along the line and fold it in the middle to obtain a hanging message. Here is the notebook and here we have the classic uh, Moleskin logo and it opens like flip top it doesn't open like a book so you have to just you know push it upward and then we have looks like the touch even a small uh, you know group brochure or guide we just set this aside and there's even a small sticker which I have noticed in with every uh, Moleskine notebook okay so this is the front side and this is the back side and let's take a look at it so you can see right away that you know there's some uh, dots and arrows right here and here we have a space for a uh, date looks like it's a date and then if we flip more pages then okay so looks like it's the same thing all over uh, somehow I was expecting there's going to be a section by section uh, divider but looks like no so it's kind of you know if you want to divide it by section then you can just write heading on the top so the paper is a little bit uh, you know it's not uh, uh, thin it's, it's a thick paper which is very good and then it's ruled on both sides of the paper and looks like we have moleskin on the bottom of the lower section each page and at the end of the notebook uh, actually the end cover is harder than the front cover the front cover is a kind of like you know a soft cover it's not uh, hard but the end cover is hard cover okay so what I'll do uh, I'll just do the writing test and see if there's ink bleeding or how it feels to write so I have a ballpoint pen and then I have a roller ball gel ink pen and we'll take a look at both of them Okay, so you can see that it writes very smoothly and if you look 
on the back of the paper uh, there's no ink bleeding there's no nothing so it looks like the paper is absorbing the pressure and the writing very well and uh, the paper quality is very good this can be a very good travel notebook as well uh, due to its size you can e easily slip it into your backpack or pocket or your sling bag and if you need then you can just like you know uh, tear off each page because you know all the pages are perforated so that's a, a good thing the notebook overall looks very nice and uh, you know uh, good looking and definitely I'm happy with the purchase and uh, I have other notebook reviews if you like to see them uh, you can just you know search on this channel and all of the reviews are non-affiliated unbiased and honest thank you for watching this video forget about subscribing this channel forget about liking this video there will be more videos coming up, so I'll see you shortly. Thank you.